morning. Praise be to God. Hallelujah. Good morning. Good morning. And good morning again to God be the glory. What a wonderful and wondrous day it is. In the name of Jesus, we are here for thankful Thursday. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. To God be the glory. Come on in. Come on in. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. We are going to fellowship this morning in the name of Jesus. To God be the glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So thankful and so glad to be before you once more and again on today. Just thankful for the presence of God and his grace and his mercy and his love. You know, that's just unbeatable and we wouldn't know what to do without it. So I am always so happy and anxious to come before you and message to bring the message of God that God gave me in the name of Jesus. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Come on in. Come on in. Hallelujah. Praise God. To God be the glory. This is Minister's Minutes with Minister Tolliver, where I interrupt your scrolling and park on your timeline so that we can fellowship on worship, word, and wisdom. To God be the glory. Uh, each weekday, Monday through Friday at 1130 a.m. Central Standard Time. And if you are able to join, please join, please join. Tag a friend, share the message in the name of Jesus so that God's word will have maximum impact. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> glory to God. I just wanted to, uh, of course, take a moment to wish all the birthday people for today a happy birthday and for the month of January, happy birthday. May God bless you with many, many more in the name of Jesus. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I just want to say hi to my sisters, my family, my friends. Hey, Vern. Hey, Tracy. Hey, Tracy. Um, so, yes. All the birthdays on today, please be blessed and have a happy one. Also, uh, sending prayers out to all those who are grieving and mourning from loss. Uh, we want to uh, also lift up in prayer a couple of people that had emergency surgeries on yesterday. Um, so Deacon McKinney, Deacon Barbara McKinney, and um, Mother Mary Williams, even if you don't know them, Please know that your prayers are welcome and we are trusting God in the name of Jesus for a full recovery. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Ministers Minutes with Minister Tolliver, where we fellowship on worship, word, and wisdom. To God be the glory. Let us have worship, God. Thank you, Jesus. Whew. Just think about the goodness of God. Think about all that he is to you, all he has done to you, all he has done for you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Just think upon the goodness of his grace and his mercy. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we worship you in spirit and in truth. Hallelujah, God, right now in the name of Jesus. We come before you with open hearts, gladness, and thanksgiving, God. Right now, Father, in the name of Jesus, we exalt your name, Father. We lift up holy hands, oh God, because you are worthy to be praised. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God, for blood running warm in our veins. Thank you, God, for one more day to try, one more time to get right, God, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, God, we worship you, Father. You deserve all the praise, all the honor, and all the glory. Hallelujah. Thank you, God, for who you are and what you are. Thank you, God, for all things great and small. You are the Alpha and the Omega, God, and all things in between. Hallelujah. We lift your name on high, God. Please, Lord, come and inhabit our praise, God, in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, look and have mercy on us, God. Anything that we said, done, or thought that was contrary to your will, God, please look and have have mercy and forgive us, oh God. In the name of Jesus, Father, we lift your name on high. 
Oh, hallelujah. Glory to your name, God. Please, Lord, inhabit our praise, God. Rest and walk among us, God. Stretch out your hand on the sick and the shut in. Stretch out your hand on those less fortunate. Stretch out your hand on those who are healing from sickness and pain and trauma, oh God. Oh, we lift you up, Father, because we know you have the victory. <laughs> yes, God. Yes, God. Yes. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to your name, God. Please inhabit this message, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Hide me behind the cross, God, that only your message will come forth, God. Bless those that will come into this live right now, God. Bless those who would share it, oh God. Bless those who would catch it on the replay, God. In the name of Jesus, I stand as your servant, God, exalting your holy name, loving you and worshiping you and honoring you, God. Oh God, thank you so so much God we love you we honor you and we give you the praise hallelujah hallelujah thank you Lord mm, amen amen oh glory to God amen hallelujah thank you Jesus I love him so and I know you do too to God be the glory thank you Jesus what a wonderful, wonderful worship. Hallelujah. It is always good to enter into his house with thanksgiving. Amen. To enter into his praise with thanksgiving. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. We worship him. Yes, God. Yes, God. Yes. Woo. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father, for a wonderful worship in the name of Jesus. Let us go to the word. Today, our scripture text will be coming from Philippians chapter 4, verses 6 through 9. Mm -hmm. Philippians chapter 4, verses 6 through 9. In the name of Jesus, to God be the glory. Go ahead and prepare yourselves to go into the word. I'll be coming from the NIV version. And the word of the Lord reads as thus. Rejoice in the Lord always. I will say it again. Rejoice. Let your gentleness be evident to all. The Lord is near. Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. And the peace of God which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds in Christ Jesus. Finally, brothers and sisters, whatever is true, whatever is noble, whatever is right, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is admirable, if anything is excellent or praiseworthy, think about such things. Whatever you have learned or received or heard from me or seen in me, put into practice and the God of peace will be with you. Mm. Hallelujah. Hang your head right there in the name of Jesus. May the Lord bring a blessing to the reading, hearing and doing of his most holy word. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. God says that our message on today that he wants us to hear and get inside of our spirits is being a prayer warrior. Mm, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Being a prayer warrior. Go ahead and put the praying hands in the comments. Put that emoji in there, praying hands, so that we are all connected and on one accord, that we touch and agree. Being a prayer warrior. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. God says that being in being a prayer warrior, when a situation occurs or any type of urgent need occurs or any type of need whatsoever, and you are a believer and in the body of Christ, all differences are set aside. Hallelujah. All differences are set aside. We know that no one um, gets along 150% 
all the time. And especially sometimes in the church. Amen. And God is saying that as a prayer warrior in the body of Christ, walking, talking, and living his teachings, amen, that when someone needs prayer, as a prayer warrior, all differences are set aside. All that stuff is out the window. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. There's a song that says, um, they'll know we are Christians by our love. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Meaning that being a prayer warrior, all love comes before anything. Amen. Love for Christ, love for your fellow man, and especially love for each other. Amen. So that means being a prayer warrior, all differences are set aside. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. To God be the glory. You know, some of us want to hold on to something forever. Some of us want to hold on to stuff just to hold on to it. We still call ourselves saved. We still call ourselves Christians. We still call ourselves in the body of Christ. But we are carrying that bone with the, the worst in us. And we won't pray for folk that need it when they need it. We won't reach out a helping hand for somebody we got that bone with. And that is not the way that God wants us to go. Oh, come on, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Talk to us right now. In the name of Jesus, all differences are set aside as a prayer warrior. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Because as a warrior, mm, let's talk about it. Being a warrior is being on the wall, being on the battlefield, being on the front line, being in a state of mind and spirit, hallelujah, ready, brave, confident in the Lord, hallelujah, and you will go forth strongly in prayer. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Come on, Holy Ghost. God says that there are some certain characteristics of a prayer warrior. You want to hear? Okay, here they go. To God be the glory. The characteristics of being a prayer warrior are, one, their constant and consistent praise. Being a prayer warrior means you have constant and consistent praise. There's not you ain't happy about God one day and then not too happy the next day. You're always ready with a praise. You're always lifting him up. You're always recognizing, amen, that God is in control. Hallelujah. And not only that, you happy about it. This is verse four. Verse four says, rejoice in the Lord always. Mm -hmm. And it was certainly important because he said it again. I will say it again. Rejoice. Oh, glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Being a prayer warrior means that you have constant and consistent praise. Hallelujah. You always find a reason to rejoice in the name of Jesus. In spite of it all, in the midst of it all, in front of it all, in the name of Jesus, you always have a constant and consistent praise. Mm. Come on, Holy Ghost. Next, and secondly, as being a prayer warrior, you're always peace-filled and prayer ready. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. The word says in verse six, do not be anxious about anything. This is where you are peace Field. Hallelujah. The world may be just going crazy all around you. Situations and circumstances, you know, the enemy might be running rampant up and through and around your life. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. But when you are peace filled, hallelujah, you do not be anxious about anything. Hallelujah. But in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your requests to God. Hallelujah. And as a prayer warrior, this is where you are prayer ready. See, because God dwells here. God dwells when you are peace filled and prayer ready. God dwells here and he guards. Mm, thank you, Jesus. 
Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Mm. God dwells in your peace-filled prayer readiness. And he guards because here is where also the enemy's attacks get harder. The enemy is working harder against you when you are peace filled and prayer ready. Come on, Holy Spirit. We are talking about being prayer warriors. This ain't for folk on milk. This is for folk on spiritual meat. In the name of Jesus, God is getting serious with us. Come on, use me, Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Ooh, thank you, Jesus. Third characteristic of being a prayer warrior is focused in faith. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Focused in faith. And verse 8 says, finally, brothers and sisters, whatever is true, whatever is noble, whatever is right, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely, whatever is admirable, if anything is excellent or praiseworthy, think about such things. Hallelujah. When you are focused in faith, it is very, very different from being regularly focused. Focus without faith is called concentration. Mm, come on, Holy Spirit. Anybody can concentrate. It's when you're paying intent intention to what you are doing or what someone is saying. Amen. But when you are focused in faith, hallelujah, thank you, Jesus, you carry integrity in your soul. This is what it means. Whatever is right, pure, lovely, admirable, anything excellent or praiseworthy, ball that up together, darling. It is integrity of your spirit for God. Mm. Come on, Holy Ghost, hallelujah, thank you, Jesus. Oh, Lord God, thank you. And fourth, a characteristic of being a prayer warrior is that you carry clear priority to God. Hallelujah. Clear priority to God in the name of Jesus. Verse 9 says, whatever you have learned or received or heard from me or seen in me, Put it into practice. Hallelujah. And the God of peace will be with you. Thank you, God. In the name of Jesus. This is where as a prayer warrior, you carry a clear priority. Your fruits are visible. Make no mistake about it. You can be seen from a mile away because your light is shining in the bright wattage of Jesus. Mm, come on, Holy Ghost. As a prayer warrior, you are ready. You are on the lookout for it. In the name of Jesus, God has given you a sense. God has given you a sight where you can see those in need and your spirit cries out to pray for Ah, glory to God. Thank you, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Make us warriors for you, Father, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. So being a prayer warrior, amen, all differences are set aside in the name of Jesus. You prioritize the first things first. It's all about love. Amen. If you love Jesus, you must also love your brother and sister. Amen. Constant and consistent praise. Peace filled and prayer ready. I've never seen a prayer warrior deny somebody prayer. Uh, amen. In the name of Jesus, being a prayer warrior means you are always at the ready. In the name of Jesus, focused in faith. Hallelujah. Faith is the substance, and we know that. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. And here in verse 7, it says that the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and your minds. Because when you are peace filled and focused in faith, the enemy gets stirred up. Hallelujah. And he, he want to come. But as a prayer warrior, you can take Satan face to face. 
face and stand toe to toe and tell him, you ain't got nothing coming here, Satan. You can't have these people. You can't have God's people. I'm taking back everything you took from me, Satan. In the name of Jesus, to God be the glory. God, in the name of Jesus, Satan, you can't cancel. You can cancel your contract. Satan, we move you out the way. We rebuke you right now in the name of Jesus. Flee in the name of Jesus. As a prayer warrior, you can send Satan back to where he go. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, God. Thank you, Jesus. We can send Satan back to where he go. Hallelujah. Mm. Thank you, Father God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. In the name of Jesus. Glory to your name, God. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Oh, to God be the glory. Thank you, Jesus. We're talking about being a prayer warrior. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Mm. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I thank you for this moment in your presence, God. Thank you, God, for your presence. Thank you for the power of your message, God. Please, God, just rain down your anointing on all those under the sound of my voice. God, have your way in a mighty and a special way in the name of Jesus. God, thank you for making us prayer warriors, God, in the name of Jesus. Let us seek you more. Let us look for you in our lives more. Let us reach for you more. And let us most of all love our fellow man. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Give God some praise. Give God some praise. This has been Minister's Minutes with Minister Tolliver, where we fellowship on worship, word, and wisdom. To God be the glory. I love you like Jesus loved the church. And remember, always work on being a prayer warrior. Bye, y'all.